new morning, new day. I'm gonna have a great day today. I slept so well that I just feel incredibly good right now. I gotta go downstairs and see what my parents made for breakfast. I'm so hungry right now. So. Yeah, I'll be at work as soon as I take the kid to school. I'm on my way. So we'll talk about it when I get there. Well, I hope you have everything ready for me when I arrive. Hey, Dad, did you make me anything for breakfast? I'm so hungry I could eat a ton of candy. No, I didn't have time to cook you anything. I'll give you some diamonds so you can buy something to eat in the school cafeteria. Try not to waste it. Take it and enjoy it. And now you need to get ready for school and hurry up. I have to get to work on time. So many diamonds. Thank you. I'm already running to get ready for school and I'll make it quick. Thank you for giving me so much. I'll try not to spend it all at once. And so where's mine? Uh, I'm finally awake, awake and alert, and I have a full day of adventures ahead of me. I should go to the kitchen and see if my parents have cooked me something because I'm full of energy right now, but I'm incredibly hungry. Oh, it's the gas and light bill again. I don't have the money to pay it. They're charging me so much that before I can pay one bill, I get a new one. I can't live like this. Hey, Dad, what's wrong? You look sad. Oh, son, this is hard to explain. Come sit with me. Okay, I'm sitting down. What are you so sad about? Look at this bill. I'm supposed to pay it in a couple days, but I don't have the money. It's gonna get us evicted. And now I get it, but what are we supposed to do? It would be bad if we didn't have a place to live. Don't worry, son. All it takes is 32 diamonds. I think I know where I can get them. So we're just gonna keep living in the house? I'll take care of the bills myself. Don't worry. The main thing is that you study hard and get the knowledge you need. By the way, it's time for you to go to school, so hurry up. It'll be bad if you're late for class. So stop sitting with me and being sad. Yeah, well, I'm all packed and ready to go to school, but I still have time. Hurry up and go to school, where new adventures await you. It's unbelievable how much they want for just water and electricity. All right, good luck, Dad. I'm out of here. My dad's so upset about these bills, it's terrible. I finally got to school. It's such a long way. I wish my dad had a car and could drive me around. It would be so cool. Everyone would be jealous of me. It's the best school in town. I have to get good grades to please my dad. I hope this at least makes him a little happy. After all those bills. Wow, that's a cool car. It's obviously a very rich man's ride. I wish I could take my dad for a ride like that. And here we are at school. Don't forget to get good grades today and save the money I gave you. That car is so expensive. Yes, I'll try to get good grades. But can you give me some more money? The cafeteria food is very expensive. All right, take it. So much, I promise I'll get good grades and make you happy. Thank you. I'll keep track of what I spend that money on. Well, run to school, but I have to hurry to work. I'm already late. Well, good luck at work. Wow, his dad is so rich that he drives such a cool car and gives him so much money. I want my dad to be so cool and rich. I should meet him. Then maybe he'll give me some money and that would be cool. I hope he's in the same class as me. That would be great. I'll wait here and try to call him. See if he wants to be my friend. I'm finally in school. Classes haven't started yet, and I have time. Hey, hey, are you going to class too? What? Yeah, I was gonna go to class. Cool, me too. But it's a couple minutes before school starts, so we can just stand here and talk while no one's around. So, my name is JJ, and I go to school here. And what's your name? My name is Mikey, and I'm a student here like you. So what did you want to talk about? I thought we could be friends and help each other with homework and tests if they come up. Wow, that sounds awesome, I agree. It's cool to have friends. We can help each other with things and always get everything in on time and play games together and have fun. Yeah, that sounds really cool. Look what I wrote on the board in this class. Looks like it's for us. Like and subscribe. Yes, I think it's written for everyone. It can help us to be more popular. So everyone should take that advice and do it right now. I think you're right. We should go to class. Classes should start soon and I don't want to be late because the teacher might scold again and call the parents and then they'll be sad. Yeah, come on. I don't want to be late too. I think we should sit next to each other. Yeah, that's a cool idea. Then we can cheat off each other and give each other tips. Three hours later. Everybody shut up! Get down on the ground and nobody will get hurt. I'll take the money and I'll leave right away. Don't move or I'll shoot you. So don't move and give me your money. Don't play with me! This is a robbery! I won't repeat myself. I will shoot you if anyone scream. Wow, that was surprisingly easy. Everyone's so docile when you yell at them and point a gun at them. Good thing I'm on my bike and I can get out of here fast. Now I have enough money to pay my bills and more. It was easy and I did it. I'm so energized right now. I'm finally home after such a hard and long day. I studied so much today 
that I'm incredibly tired. I hope my dad is home by now and I can show him that I got a bunch of good grades and make him happy because he was so sad this morning and that's too bad. Hey dad, it's weird he's not home. Usually when I get home, he's already home. Hmm, maybe he was late at work. Oh, I hear the sound of his bike. He must be pulling up. I'm finally home. That was dangerous. Hi, JJ. Hey dad. We gotta get out of here before the cops come in here and bust me. So pack your things quickly. What? What's wrong? Why do I have to pack my stuff? Why do the cops want to bust you? Son, I robbed a bank and I got a lot of diamonds and now all the cops in town are after me. We need to pack up our stuff and get out of town before the cops find us. Pack your things fast. But why did you rob a bank? Because we didn't have any money. So pack your things. But I don't have a lot of stuff, so I'm all set. Okay, I'll be ready in a little while. We have to get out of here before the cops come. We'll go someplace nice and live rich because I stole a lot of diamonds and now we'll have enough for a very rich life for the rest of our lives. What? What are those noises? What? What are you talking about? I can't hear anything. Are you okay, Dad? Can't you hear that noise? The cops are here. Freeze! Everybody on the ground! It's the police! Oh, no. We've got the thief. Get him. No, wait. That's my dad. Back off, kid. We got your dad. He's a dangerous criminal who's been threatening people with guns. Ow, 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 ow. That hurts. My dad's in pain! That's the way it's supposed to be. Back off, kid. You've already got him! Good job, guys. You got him. This guy was incredibly dangerous, but you handled it. You did a great job. I deserve that money. You deserve to be in jail for the rest of your life. Sir, what do we do now? All right, kid. Dad's going to jail. Pack him up, boys, and go to the police in case closed. I can't go to jail. Wait! Get up, come on. Don't touch me. I can get up on my own. You'll pay for grabbing me. I'm innocent. Shut up and get out of here. You'll have to plead your case in jail. Wait, but what am I supposed to do alone? You have to let him go. Please, we'll get back everything he took. Bring him back. I can't live without him. Look, kid, you're an adult and you can live on your own. Your father should go to court and face him for what he did. He broke a lot of rules and robbed a bank. But! No buts. I told you everything. Sir, we're ready to go. All right. Go to the station. I'll be here for a second, and I'll be right behind you. You learn to live on your own, and don't get upset. It's your father's fault for robbing the bank and leaving you alone. He knew what he was doing. I can't believe they just took him away. What now? Let me go now. I want my lawyer. I'm being handcuffed. It wasn't me. Shut up already. You'll rot in jail for life. Ha ha ha. Catching you was easy. Oh my god. I can't go to jail. Someone has to take care of my son. He'll be lost on his own without me. He can't go to an orphanage. Oh my god. Yeah, my dad was a complete idiot. He could have just gotten a job in a factory instead of robbing a bank. But still, I'll be sad without my daddy. Who's gonna buy me food now? Never mind. And now it's cartoon time. Six months later. Hi friends, I'm getting used to living without my dad, and today I have Mikey as my guest. Hey everybody, tonight we're having a super duper cool party at JJ's house. Oh yeah, I'm a little bored living alone at home without my mom and dad. Of my friends, all I have left is Mikey and a bunch of cockroaches running around on the floor. I hope they don't eat me. Don't be afraid, Mikey. I tamed them, just like pets. So how do you like my house? It's a little dirty, but it's still cozy. It's very dusty, and there are cobwebs everywhere. You might want to clean it up. It's cool, though. I'll do it later. Better check out my toy collection. This toy's name is Bob. Then comes Peter. Then Ilya. Those are some weird names for your toys. But it doesn't matter. I wanted to brag that I have a whole bunch of them at home. Hey, JJ. I finally broke out of that stinking prison. Whoa. Hi, Dad. I'm glad to see you. And this is Mikey, my friend. We play toys together. Yes, your son invited me here. He says he has more toys at home. Oh, more toys at home? Does Mikey live with a rich family? Yes, he's very rich rich. Much richer than you. Wow, you must have something to eat every day. Oh yeah, I eat ten times a day. I wish I could live my life like Mikey. Yes, then I have one idea how we can get rich. Wow, my dad's gonna get a job. No, jobs are for stupid people. JJ, grab Mikey and take him to the basement. He's gonna be our hostage. Whoa, dad, easy. Put the gun away. Hands up. Wait, calm ah! down. Oh my god, dad, what did you do? Are you out of your mind? That was my friend. He's not your friend. He's rich and greedy, and we are poor. We'll demand a ransom from his family. I'm not doing this! You will do whatever I say. Get him to the basement, now! No, I would never betray my friend. I will not help you commit another crime. Stop! I command you to obey me. Come back here! Never! I care more about Mikey than you. Three hours later. Oh my god, this headache is so bad. What's going on? Where did I wake up? I'm in some smelly, damp, poor basement. It's not such a stinky basement. Shut up, or I'll hit you again. Let me go, please. Ha ha ha, let you go? Ha ha, you're so funny. Your family will pay me a lot of money to release you. And I'll use the money to buy a cool house with a nice basement. I hate rich people. They took all the money from poor people. Just get a job, man. No, it's too long, boring, and difficult. Oh my god, I didn't expect my father to be capable of doing such a bad thing 
thing a second time at all. I'm very angry and resentful of my dad, but how can I help Mikey? He's my friend. I have to save him from that basement, but I can't do anything at all because I'm small and weak. Daddy will just hit me because he's an adult. I'm so helpless and no one in this world can help the little boy at the bus stop. Hey, why are you crying alone? What's wrong, kid? Oh my God, what is this monster in front of me? Wow, you're so muscular. So why are you crying? My friend is being badly abused. That's why I'm offended. What's the big deal? Just punch the offender, that's all. It's not that simple. The abuser is my father. He's too big and strong. <laughs> You're whining like a little girl. Take matters into your own hands, get stronger, and beat your father. If you try hard enough, you can beat anyone. It's worth it just to get pumped up at my super duper awesome gym. What? The gym? Are you saying that I can become as strong as you? Oh yeah, <laughs> look at my hands. These two friends can easily beat any person in the world. But I'm only six years old. I can't get that big. And I'm five years old. It's not a problem at all. Follow me. I will become your personal trainer. You'll make a great jock. Wow, this is what I need. I agree. Let's go. My muscles will be as big as yours. Oh, yeah. When are we coming? I already want to become super strong. We've already arrived, baby. My personal gym is located here. Boys become real men here. Wow, becoming a man at six is pretty cool. But I just want to save my best friend from captivity. Patience, baby. You need to train long and hard to become strong and big. But I don't have time for this. I have to help my friend right now. Okay, I get you. Then we will be engaged in an accelerated program for muscle gain. Okay, I'm completely at your disposal, coach. Where should I start? Um, let me think about it. You're so small and weak. <laughs> I've never seen such weak guys. Oh my God, it sounded insulting. Stop whining, girl. Start lifting the dumbbells. Now we're going to make you a super jock. Oh my God, I don't think I'm capable of moving this at all. Moments later. That's it. I've had enough of this gym. I've already become stronger than you, coach. Why are you all breaking down doors? Do you even know how much it costs? You are freaks. I'm not a freak. I'm JJ. Or rather, a stronger version of the old and weak JJ. Ha 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 ha. Mikey, I'm coming to save you. Wait for me. I hate these kids. They spoil everything all the time. Get out of here. And here is my old house. My dad clearly has no idea that he's going to be in a lot of pain soon. Friends, do you want to be as strong? Then like this video. Hey, is anyone at home? I'm back from school. Ha ha ha. Oh yes, dad was talking about the basement. I should go there. When are your parents coming? I'm tired of waiting for them here. I do not know where they are. All you have to do is call them. I don't have a cell phone. This device is too expensive. Stop pointing that thing at me. Ha ha ha. Are you afraid? Ha ha ha. Get your hands off my friend, you stinking criminal. Oh my god, JJ, why have you become so big? It looks like he's pumped up. I came here to save Mikey. No, I'll sell the Mikey to his family. You're not taking him away from me. Get your hands off him, otherwise I'll hit you. I'm not afraid of you. Ha ha ha, I'm going to knock you out. Nah, nah, nah! That's it. No one can hurt my best friend, even my own father. Oh, I was waiting for the police, but you came, JJ. It's amazing. You're my friend. We have to help each other. Okay, I'm really glad to see you. It's so cool to be friends with a strong dude like you. By the way, maybe you can untie me because these ropes are so uncomfortable. Okay, one second. Tadam, you're free, Mikey. Thanks, JJ. You're a real lifeguard. I am so thankful to you. Friends, would you like to beat your parents? Write about it in the comments. I really liked beating my dad. I I hope I don't go to jail for this. I don't think anyone gets jailed for protecting friends. You're right, Mikey. Let's get out of this rotten and smelly basement already. Okay, no one likes being in basements. Although my dad and I live here in winter because it can be cold at home. But we don't have money for a heater. Okay, I'm going home and you beat your dad up again so he doesn't do any more crimes. Okay, Mikey, I'll keep an eye on him. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, JJ. I'll see you at school. Bye-bye. See you tomorrow, Mikey. The next morning. I had such a good night's sleep. I just woke up and I slept so well. Now I need to eat a big meal. I hope my mom cooked me something. I have to go to school today. And I wouldn't want to study hungry because that way I'd be thinking about food instead of knowledge. I'm almost done making breakfast pie. Whoa! Yeah, but it's too late. We gotta pack up and go. Already? I want to try mom's pie. It's time to go. But I'm really hungry. How am I gonna study if I don't eat? You can have pie after school. Wow, it's already time to run to school. Well, okay, but I'll be hungry all day at school. 
What am I going to do? Daddy can give you money for food, and you'll eat. I can give you money. The school cafeteria has a lot of good food that's not expensive at all. Yeah, see? You won't starve. Sounds good. Cool. Yeah, that's cool. Here you go. Try not to spend it all at once. You should have enough for the day. Thanks, Dad. I'll try not to spend it all at once. Good luck with your studies, honey. Thank you, Mom. Okay, come on. If you're late for school, it's too bad, and you might get detention. I don't want to hear from your teachers about your behavior. Hurry up. I'm on my way. Hopefully, there'll be something nice and appetizing in the cafeteria. I bought a new car. Get in and try not to get the seats dirty. This car is very expensive. Wow, this car looks really cool. Yeah, that car looks cool. My dad makes so much money he can afford a cool car and give me money for the school cafeteria. Hurry up. Wow, this car is so big inside and it looks so cool. It's lucky the roads are clear today and no one will stop us from getting to school. Otherwise, we'd be stuck in traffic and you'd be late for school, which would be terrible. Yeah, they give you a big scolding at school when you're late for class. It's bad. They can call the parents. We finally arrived. It takes a huge amount of time to get here, even if you drive a car. Let's hurry up. There's still a little time before school starts and you'll be late. I hope you can walk to your class by yourself. Hurry up and go. But remember, I gave you money for food, not toys. So don't spend it on anything and only use it when you're hungry. Well, I'm finally at my favorite school for kids. I'll try to get good grades and make you happy. And I'll keep track of the money you gave me. Yes, yes, don't forget to make friends. It might help you. And they can help you with your studies or if you suddenly get into trouble. Yes. I'll try to find friends. Good luck, Dad. I can't believe how cool my dad is. He bought himself such an expensive car and gave me so much money so that I wouldn't be hungry while I was in school. I hope I'm not late for class yet. We always have food machines at the entrance in case anyone gets hungry. It's strange that there's no one there. It looks like classes haven't started yet, and I came too early. Wow, someone wrote subscribe and like, I think this is good advice and it's worth doing it. Oh, hi. Did you come very early too? Yes, I thought lessons had already started, but it turned out there wasn't even anyone here yet. Hmm, someone wrote there to subscribe and like, I think this is cool advice. Yeah, my dad told me to find friends, so won't you be my friend? Yes, of course. I would also like to have friends at school. It's so boring during recess and there's no one to play with, so I'll be happy to be friends with you. Yeah, that sounds cool. We can play at recess and help each other if we need anything. You're so cool. Yes, we need to quickly go to class and take the best seats before no one comes. Otherwise, we will have to take the front seats and we will most likely be called to the board and asked questions. And I don't like being bombarded with questions about knowledge. Yes, I'm also not a good student, and that's why I can't answer something normally at the board. Look, these are the best places where we won't be noticed. And so children, take your seats and prepare your sheets. Now I will explain your task to you, and you will individually write a test, after which I will give you grades on your knowledge that you acquired this weekend. I hope I pass this test. I promised my parents I would get good grades. I also bring good grades to my parents. Parents. Yes, I think we can pass this test and get good grades. And so Three hours later. I can't believe it. I didn't even think that I would be able to pass the test so well and get all the good grades. Hey, my friend is crying. I need to ask what happened. Maybe I can help. What happened? Why are you crying? You won't believe it. I failed the test and they gave me a bunch of bad marks. And now I won't be allowed to go out and have fun. Wow, this is very bad. If you are not allowed to go out and play with me, then I will have no one to play with. But listen, we can go to you and I will help you learn this difficult test and teach you how to solve it, after which you can retake it with an excellent grade and we can play outside together. Besides, I passed everything perfectly. I know how to solve. Well, this sounds very strange, but cool. I agree. Let's come to me. I'll show you where I live and I hope you'll teach me how to solve these difficult problems. Yes, I solved everything perfectly, so I know well how to solve these problems. Look, it's still written there. Subscribe and like. I think it's really a good action since it's still there. Yes, I think it's worth doing it right now and life will become better. Better. I think so, too. Yep, let's go to my house. If we go now, we will get to it in a couple of hours, and you will teach me how to solve these problems. Don't be afraid. It's easy. Finally, we are at my house. The journey to your house took a very long time. I hope you learn quickly, and I will have time to get home to tell my parents about my successes today. Your house looks poor. Don't you like my house? Yep, he doesn't.
doesn't look very good, but don't be afraid. Well, I don't think there will be any problems, but he certainly looks strange. Yup, it looks weird, but I like it. Okay, let's go see you. I can't wait to start teaching you. Wow, there are so many cobwebs in your house. I hope all the spiders have already escaped from here. Oh my god, what a delicious swill. I can't believe it. Is this your dad? He drinks. Yes, he drinks often. And who else is this? Who did you bring to our house? This is my friend from school. He came with me to help me learn to solve problems from the test that was given today. Did you pass your subject test today? Yes, he is from a rich family. He is good at solving tests. Yes, that's right. I wanted to help. From a rich family? Do you have money or diamonds? Or are you a little liar who just lied to my son so he could come visit him? No, my dad is rich, and he gave me several diamonds. So I really want to help my friend understand the test so that he can solve it well. Wow, okay, kids, go to your room to study, and while I'm here, I'll mind my own business. Dad looks weird. Better let's go here. This is my place. Here you can help me solve these problems. Wow, you have a lot of books. I think it won't take much time, and it will be easy for for me to teach you how to solve these problems. Hey, come here. Let him solve his problems himself. But I want to help. This is not your problem, and you don't need to help him. He should solve them himself. Otherwise, he won't learn anything. You're starting to make me angry. But Dad! None, but you got a bad grade, and you think you're going to have a good time? You really upset me, and your friend is starting to piss me off with his boorish behavior. But I want to help my friend. It looks like you were raised poorly, and you don't understand when they tell you to mind your own business. <laughs> Oh no, my friend. Dad, why did you hit him? He just wanted to help me with my homework. I already told you that you have to do your homework yourself. Otherwise, you will get the same as he did, and it's none of your business. You sit in your place and start doing your homework, and when I return, you better know how to solve them. Otherwise, you will get even more than him. And if I hear you cry again, you won't go out at all and make friends with anyone else. So, let's go to your place and start doing your homework. Until I got even angrier. You hit my friend! He wanted to help me! I will run away from you because you are very angry! And I will call someone to help me! You are very angry and scary! Come on, stop little freak! If you run away now, I will find you and beat you! I don't want to live with you! You hit my friend! It's terrible! You will still get yours, just like your friend got it? Came back quickly, don't make me mad! Or you'll get even more than your friend got? I told Two you! Two hours later... Oh god, my head hurts so bad! I got hit right in the head and I just passed out! I can't believe I'm tied up. What should I do now? I'm tied up in the basement. It's unclear where. My parents will worry. Besides, it smells terrible here and I hear someone. Help me. Yes, don't scream, baby. No one will hear you here and no one will come for you. I hope you are very comfortable here because until your rich parents pay for you, they will not get you back. But you can't do that. Yes, I can and will do so. I'm tired of living in misery while all sorts of rich people drive around in their cool cars and enjoy a fun life. I also want to live luxuriously and enjoy Enjoy everything in life. You will be imprisoned for capturing me and keeping me in such a bad place. Shut up. I know what will happen. I will get a whole lot of money for you, and I will go to live in beautiful places, and no one will stop me. So sit here and enjoy your camera while I figure out how to tell your parents so they can pay me. No one will pay you, and I'll get out of here. But what should I do now if my parents don't pay him back? I need to figure out what to do. <laughs> Oh my god, there's no way I can help JJ. He spent tons of diamonds for me, trying to help me with my homework, and now he's a prisoner. Hey baby, why are you crying? There's some kids crying at this bus stop again. Oh my god, what's that monster next to me? What do you mean a monster? I'm just a pumped up, good looking dude. I also own my own gym. Tell me what's wrong with you, kid. Haha. <laughs> my dad kidnapped my best friend in the basement. Now he's beating him, and if I go back to him, he'll beat me too. That's why I'm sitting here all sad. I'm a helpless little kid who can't do anything to him, and no one's gonna help me. I'll help you. I can make you stronger because I'm a super duper awesome trainer at my gym. You're gonna beat your dad. <laughs> You'll also get bigger, just like me, because your muscles will make you bigger. Oh, this is just what I need. I will do anything to save my friend because he risked his life for me. Oh yeah, that's the spirit I like. Come with me. You're gonna be a super duper jock, but you're gonna have to do a little iron work. Uh, you look like you're in your 40s, and I'm only six. Who cares, though? Logic doesn't work in the world of Minecraft. I'll do whatever you say, coach. Make me the toughest TV man in the world. I want to be like you. Then get up and go to my gym. Only there can you become cool and strong like me. Oh, yeah. I hope I'm not doing something stupid like running. Shut up, rookie. I'm the trainer here, and I know better than you how to grow muscles. <laughs> wow, that coach is a really cool dude. Way cooler than you. Three hours later. Oh, yeah. I've pumped everything. 
every muscle in my body. I believe I am ready to fight my greatest enemy, the doors. Why did you break down the doors, idiot? Because they got in my way. Nothing and no one can stop me from saving my best friend. With such big muscles and body, I could easily beat my father. JJ, I'm coming to save you. Friends, anybody, help. I've been in this basement for hours. No one will help me. Hey, TV man, let me go at last. I didn't do anything to you. Are you even listening to me? My mom's waiting for me at home. Shut up. You're keeping me from doing nothing and living in poverty. Uh, what are you even talking about? Untie me. It's against the law to steal children. No, I hate all you rich people. You took all my money. You didn't even have any money at all. I should know better how much money I have. You just sit there quietly or I'll hit you again. <laughs> Why are you being so mean? Because I don't have enough money. Oh my god, you're gonna pay for this sooner or later. <laughs> Never. Here I am, babies. It's time to take down evil and greedy daddies. Hey, turn around. <laughs> I'm here to stuff your face, you dumb daddy. Oh my god, Mikey. Why are you getting so big and scary? Your anger at everyone around you has made me stronger. It's time for my revenge. What's he even talking about? I don't know. Mikey, hit that idiot already and set me free. Ah! That's what happens to anyone who hurts my friends. Wow, Mikey, you really are the coolest and strongest friend in the world. It's so good to see you. It's good to see you alive too, JJ. Untie me already. My arms are so stiff from sitting like this. Whoo, I'm finally free. That's the power of friendship. Mikey, how did you get so big? I met one coach who helped me get stronger. You're definitely stronger than your stupid daddy. It's very easy to hit a lying man. Oh yeah. Let's go outside already. Take that, ha <laughs> ha. I'm finally getting out of this stinking basement. Now you can come home and I can easily command my daddy to start working and stop drinking. Oh yeah, my parents must be really worried about me right now. By the way, I want muscles like yours. I'll teach you everything I know later, JJ. We're both gonna be jocks. Now you really should go home or it'll be dark soon and you might get lost on the way. Okay, Mikey, thanks again for saving me. You and I are friends and friends are supposed to help each other. Bye bye, Mikey. See you at school tomorrow. One million zillion jillion dillion cotillion times later. Ha ha ha! Did you know that wine makes your blood vessels dilate and your health better? Or they shrink? I don't remember. <laughs> I just like to drink, that's all. Ha ha ha! You're such a drunk, that's what I like about you. Then let's drink to us. Ha ha! As the perfect drunken love couple. I've already drunk five liters of wine. Drink more! We must drink it all, otherwise it'll spoil. Wine can't go to spoil, but your words sound like a toast. Ha ha ha! Let's drink to that, my love. Let's go! Ha ha ha! I'd drink with you for the rest of my life. Ha ha! Hi, Mom and Dad! I came home. Today was the first day of school. I really liked it there. I also got a good grade in reading. I can drink the whole bottle in one shot. Ha ha. You can't do that. Can I? Actually, I can drink two bottles of wine in two seconds. Ha ha. Uh, it's like my parents are too drunk to even notice me. Also, it stinks a lot and there's no food at home. I'm so sick of this. Ha ha ha. We need to buy more wine. Oh my god. All they care about is their alcohol. It's so frustrating. I'm gonna get some sleep. I've got a big day ahead of me tomorrow. Ha ha ha. You're awesome! The next day. Oh, good morning, everyone. I'm awake and ready to explore the world. It's time to eat and go to school. I hope my parents have stopped drinking. Oh my god, how pathetic they look. They look like they've been drinking all night. They look like sleeping pigs. Pigs also stink and live in a pile of garbage. I hope I don't grow up like that in the future. And actually, I thought my mom was going to make me breakfast for school. I'm gonna have to go to class hungry. How unlucky I am to have such parents. I wish I had a good and loving family where no one drinks alcohol. You know, I think you're giving me too little pocket money. I need more. If you write well on the test today, we'll give you more money. Oh, that's the way to start. I'm gonna write this test better than anyone in the class. Then go ahead and write this simple test. We believe in you, JJ. You're the best son we've ever had. And you guys are the best parents I've ever had. All right, enough talk. Go to school, otherwise you'll be late. Don't worry about it. No one starts the test until I get here. I'm the best student ever. I don't care at all. Bye-bye. Good luck on the test, JJ. Bye. Bye-bye. And you don't have to worry about me. Thanks for driving me to school. Uh, it's like no one can hear me anymore. Oh well, I gotta get to school. Being an honors student isn't easy. After all, guys, do you study hard for your tests? Write about it in the comments. I've been studying for this test all night. I could just play computer games instead. Whoa, what is that? Like and subscribe? Hey guys, like this video and subscribe to our channel. It's so good to have such a helpful school sign here. 
Oh, who's that? Do we have a new classmate? What a great school this place is! So much bigger than my little house! Ha ha! I can tell he's rarely at our school. Probably the coolest and smartest kids in the world go to a school like this. Hey, boy, wait, you're new, right? What's your name? Uh, are you talking to me? Yeah, yeah, come here, you're Mikey. Our teacher told me about you. Uh, okay, what do you want me to do? What do I want from you? I want to be friends with you. I don't think it will be easy for you to go to school alone. Oh, I like this one. I'm in. You know my name, but what's your name? Huh, my name is JJ. Nice to meet you. I feel like I've known you all my life, JJ. Ha ha ha. I understand you, but we've only known each other for a couple minutes. By the way, did you study for the school test? No, because I didn't know anything about it. I think I'll write it normally. Ha ha. I don't even know what will come out of this. Let's go to class. Let's go! Two hours later. Ha ha. I got the best grade. A plus plus. I'm so smart. My parents will be proud of me. Friends, what grades do you get in school? Write about it in the comments. As it turned out, the test wasn't hard at all. At least for me. I wonder what grade Mikey got. Hey, Mikey, why are you so sad? I got the worst grade on a school test. I couldn't write it well. Oh, an E grade? Well, people make mistakes. I got a much better grade than you. Ha ha ha. My parents would get really mad at me for that. I don't know what to do. Oh, come on. Everybody gets a bad grade once in a while. Besides, you're new to this school. My parents don't care about that. They just want good grades. Then let them go to that school themselves. Ha ha. Don't be so upset. Hey, Mikey, where'd you go? Wait for me. No offense. I was just kidding. I need to fix this grade to a good one. Oh my god. I'll help you study harder for the next test. You'll have as good a grade as me too. I don't think I can do that. Together, we can do anything, Mikey, because we're friends. Oh yeah. And friends are supposed to help each other. Thank you, JJ. Ha ha. You have nothing to thank me for yet. Let's go to your house to get ready for the test. Uh, I don't have a very rich house. I don't think you're gonna love like it. I don't care what kind of house you have up there. I just want you to get a good grade. All right, then. Then my house is that way. Follow me, JJ. Let's go, Mikey. I think we can prepare well in one day. Math isn't that hard. And here's my poor little house. Uh, your house is made of earth and straw? I certainly didn't expect that. You've already agreed to help me study for the test. It's too late to back out. Oh, my God. You have so many cobwebs in here. Wow, I think those are your parents. Yeah, they've been like that since this morning. They've had a a little alcohol. A little bit? They're sleeping in a huge pile of empty bottles. It's like they've been drinking it all night. They're not gonna bother us. You have nothing to be afraid of. Uh, all right. I hope they don't wake up and go on a rampage. They'll sleep for another 10 hours. Then get out your math book. Let's start with the topic of addition. All right, then. I don't have a table. We'll read from the floor. Uh, all right. This whole thing looks too poor, but I've agreed to help you in any way I can. There go the exercises where you got a bad grade. You're reminding me of my fails again. I told you all people make mistakes, even smart ones like me. You've got some kind of weird textbook. There's no letters and numbers. And you wonder why I failed that school test. I just thought that's what the math was. You can't learn anything from that textbook. What's going on here? Oh, my parents are awake. Uh, hello. I'm Mikey's friend. We didn't allow anyone in our house. I let him in. We wanted to study for a school test. Some strange and smelly boy. I don't like it at all. Don't swear. I just wanted to help your son. We're getting ready for math. You're an idiot, Mikey. We didn't allow anyone in the house. Stop hitting Mikey. It's not his fault he failed the test. He failed the test too? We have to punish him. Don't do that. He's in pain. Nah! He's your son. Oh my God, you gave him a black eye. You get out of here. You're not welcome here, stupid stranger. Okay, just don't hit me. I didn't steal anything. You've stolen all our wine. Now we have nothing to drink in this house. I don't need your wine. I'm not an alcoholic. You're a thief. You should be in jail. Go away. Otherwise, we'll call the police. What kind of police? You beat up your son for nothing. It's not your business. What do you mean, not my business? And how is Mikey gonna do so well on that math test? Oh my god, I feel so bad for him. Friends, do your parents beat you? Write about it in the comments. Let's see how many of us. Moments later. Yeah, that's a real problem. I'm a little kid. There's nothing I can do to help Mikey. I feel so sorry for him. I'd like to take him to live at my house, but his parents won't let me. I don't want to leave my friend. 
I think Mikey would do anything to help me if I was in danger. And I'm a weak and pathetic boy. Oh my God, how can I help Mikey? I'll just have to sit here and be sad. Hey boy, what are you so sad about? This bench is made for crybabies. <laughs> oh, who are you? Just another jock. Now that was a shame. Tell me what happened. Oh, my friend got a bad grade in school. I decided to help him study for his homework at home, but then his parents woke up and beat him up. I want to help him and get him out of there, but I'm weak and small. That's why I'm so sad. <laughs> it's no problem at all. You can always get big and strong. But how do I do it? I'm only seven years old. Me too. <laughs> I just started going to the gym and working out, and you can do it too. What? You're seven years old? That's unbelievable. Okay then, I'll agree to go to your gym. Oh, really? Whoa! <laughs> you made the right choice, boy. <laughs> you're so weird. I think you're crazy. No, I've just been going to the gym instead of school all this time. Let's go to my gym. You'll be just like me. Okay, then I can beat up Mikey's parents. I'm his friend and I'm supposed to help him. A pumped up guy can beat up any man at all. <laughs> the gym will help you with that. I really hope so, man. Let's go. When are we going to get to your gym? Patience, little man. We're here. Here's my super cool gym. You're going to love it. So here you were skipping school and growing your muscles. Muscles are more important than brains, kid. <laughs> Trust me, you'll be convinced of that more than once soon. Um, I think you're right. I'm the smartest boy in the class, but I can't do anything against Mikey's parents. Come on, let's make me a pumped up man. Make yourself at home, kid. I've got all kinds of machines and dumbbells here. Wow, it's pretty cozy in here. Now I know why jocks hang out at the gym all the time. Because there are doggy TVs here. Oh yeah, those dogs are pretty cute. Okay, coach, where do I begin to get my muscles to start growing? Uh, let me think about it. Since you're new here, you should get on the treadmill. What? Are you serious? Running? Oh my god, I hate running. It's so boring. I'm a coach. Take my orders. Three hours later. Ha ha ha. The treadmill has really made me stronger. Just don't break my gym. Ha ha ha. I'm too strong and stupid. I can't hear you. Ha ha ha. How I hate you all. You're always breaking everything around you. Stop whining, you boring man. I'm the strongest man in town now. Friends, do I look pretty now? Write about it in the comments. I think I'm super handsome. Anyone who doesn't think so, I'll find him and beat him up. Ha ha ha! Now it's time for me to go visit Mikey. It's time to get him out of there. And this is Mikey's poor, stinky house. His parents can't build a decent house. Friends, I hope you don't live in a similar place. I can destroy this entire house from the ground with just my touch. Ha 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 ha! Because I'm super strong. Mikey, I came to save you. Get your stuff. You're gonna live with me. JJ, why are you so big? You can ask questions later. Hurry up and pack your bags. It's time to get out of here. What's that noise in our house again? Oh my god, what is that monster in our hallway? Get out of here. We're afraid of you. I'm not going anywhere without my friend Mikey. He doesn't live here anymore. Uh, a fight's about to begin. We won't let you steal our baby. I'm gonna hit you now. What? You're gonna hit me? Ha 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 ha. Just try it. You'll regret it because my punch will be much stronger. Stop talking, honey. Hit him. Nah. There you go. Now you'll know how to hit the weak. You freak. Oh my god, you killed my husband, you monster. You're going to jail. Shut up, you stupid woman. You should drink less. Then no one would get hurt. Some high school kid can't shut me up. I'll beat you too. Nah, I'm gonna knock you out too. Ha ha, that was easy. JJ, you're so strong. Beating adults isn't so easy. They're drunken idiots. They're also bad parents. You'll be better off at my house. Thank you, JJ, for rescuing me from that horrible family. You're a real friend. You can thank me later. We don't have much time. Hurry up. Okay, I just need to get all my comics and toys together. For real? Okay, you can have this too. I'm ready. We can get on the road. Wow, that was fast. Well done. I knew I could trust you. I don't have a lot of stuff. Oh my god, turn around. What? What are you talking about? Hands in the air. Don't move. I'm not gonna let some idiot steal my son. Oh, does your dad have a gun? This is bad. The gun will be way cooler than a bunch of muscle. Mikey, what do we do? I didn't see that coming. Looks like your brains dried up when you were pumping your muscles. Go outside. I don't want you in my house. Okay, okay, okay. Just don't shoot anybody, okay? Shut up. You can't make conditions around here. I'm the boss now. I'll shoot you, then I'll hit Mikey and go back to drinking my wine. You're an old and stinking drunk. Oh, I wouldn't insult me if I were you. You're a stinker. Ouch! That's it. Now I'm protecting my friends. Mikey, great job. You saved me. Thank you. That was a good punch. I hit my dad for the first time. And you know, I loved it. I should do that more often. Let's go outside before your parents wake up again. I hit him so hard. I don't think he'll wake up for a couple days. I hear you, Mikey. Hitting adults is pretty cool. It should be done when they can't fight back. You're right. Now we have to go to my home. I'll finally live somewhere where I won't get beaten up. Oh, yeah. It's not cool to live in a house like this. I hope we don't have to hit your parents, too. We won't have to. The next day. 
Would you like some fries? Would you? Huh? I'm not giving you any fries. I'll eat them all myself. It's so cool to sit outdoors and eat all sorts of yummy goodies while someone else is working out at the gym. Ha ha, life is good. You girls are all so sweet. Maybe we could play together at my house. Ha ha, good idea, Mikey. You are such a fun and cool guy. Oh, Mikey, hey, long time no see, by the way. Oh my god, it's an old friend of mine who turned into a fatty. He's so fat and stinky, ha ha. Ha ha ha, you're as fat as your mom. Hey, it's not cool to insult anyone, and I'm not fat. I'm a little well-fed boy. You fatso, go eat ten more burgers. Ha ha ha. Shut up, all of you. I don't eat burgers, I'm eating fries. You can eat this. But I don't want to turn into the same ugly fat guy. Ha ha ha, JJ's a fatty. You know, Mikey, I thought we were friends, and you're so bad. I'm not gonna be friends with you anymore. You, it's not cool to be friends with a fat guy. Fat JJ with fat boobs, ha ha ha. Oh my god, it's so hurtful to hear such bad words. Girls, let's go play together and then we'll kiss each other. Oh, I like that one, let's go. Kissing? At that age, I wanna do that too, but not with those stupid girls. Women, would you like to kiss me? Write about it in the comments. I think I'm quite attractive for this. I gotta go home. Three hours later. Whew, I'm so tired of walking. I'd buy myself some kind of car to drive me home. For spending all day just walking home is not cool at all. I hope the parents cooked something delicious because I'm really hungry. Although I'm always hungry. Huh. By the way, I hate fat people. Yeah, something has to be done about them. Mom, Dad, hi, I came home. I'm also very sad. Hey, JJ, what happened to you? Everyone calls me fatso. It offends me, and I don't like it at all. Mikey did it. I thought we were friends. In fact, I've decided I'm not going to be friends with him anymore. No offense to the truth, JJ. You have a real weight problem. And actually, your mom made you a proper diet. Oh, yeah. You need to eat right, JJ. What? What diet? I like the food I ate before. I don't need anything else. No, you need to eat healthy and good food. If you eat your mom's food, you'll definitely lose weight over time. Can't you hear me? French fries and fast food are the only thing I like to eat. That kind of food is definitely not good for you. Let's go get some lunch, JJ. You must be hungry today. I've already set the table. You can eat now. What did you make for dinner anyway? I'll get it. Be patient. Come on, hurry up. Mim and I can't wait for lunch because we've been waiting for you for so long. Okay, okay, okay. I hope it's at least a little tasty and edible. Oh, JJ, I clearly don't envy you with this diet. <laughs> Mom, where's my food? I'm so hungry. I just want to say that the food will be different for dad and you. Oh, uh, really? That's not fair. Oh, that's very honest. Excellent steak. I love meat. Hey, I want that fat and delicious steak and fries, too. Give me that, too. No, JJ, this food is too bad for you. It's the most normal food ever. Oh, my God. What is that? Is that some kind of herb? I'm a human being, not a cow. I don't want to eat it. JJ, stop whining. You need to eat right to lose weight. And this food is too right for you. Just try these broccoli. You'll enjoy it. Oh, my God. Is it even edible? I really think you picked it off the ground. At least try a little piece of this, JJ. Oh my god, it still looks very raw. I would fry this in butter and breading. No oil. It's all very unhealthy and greasy for you. And where did you go? Do you really think I'm gonna eat that? Eat up and don't whine, JJ. Be a man and take a woman's reproach. I'm gonna eat this great steak. Yum, 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 yum. Friends, what would you eat? Steak or broccoli? Write about it in the comments. Hurry up and eat before it gets cold. Oh my god. Yum, 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 yum. The next day. Hello again, everyone. I somehow managed to walk to school. It was very difficult. I think I'm long overdue for my first class. It's too late to go there. I think we can spend time in the cafeteria instead of the classroom. Maybe I can buy a few cans of soda. I wonder what I'm gonna buy, Pepsi Cola or Coca-Cola? Hey guys, what would you buy? Write about it in the comments. I would buy a Coca-Cola. Oh, what's this? Our favorite sign, like and subscribe. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. And and while I was saying all that, I got even hungrier. I have to hurry to the cafeteria so I can finally eat something tasty instead of my mom's horrible food. We have all sorts of cupcakes, croissants, brownies, and lots of other yummy treats here. It all looks so delicious. But I can't decide which one I should buy. Still, I'm thinking of buying five cupcakes and five brownies. <laughs> We're so cool. It's time to make fun of someone. Oh, look at that fatso. That's the perfect target for us. Uh-oh, I think I'm in big 
trouble. Hey, come here. Did you come here to eat? <laughs> hey, guys, I don't want any trouble. Let's keep it cool. And you don't give us conditions, you fat pig. Now that was rude. Grunt, you fat, disgusting pig. You grunt, you idiot. Hey, why are you insulting my friend? You should be punished for that, piggy. He wanted to buy a brownie. Ha ha ha. That pig is hungry. This has nothing to do with you. Ouch. Hit him, boys. Ouch. He's too Ow. soft. It's time to Ouch. shake this pig up. Will you please stop doing that? I'm in a lot of pain. Take that. You insulted our friend. That's bad. It's time to punish you. Ow, don't do that. Ouch. <laughs> You're so nasty and stinky. Ow, stop it. <laughs> but find ow. that piggy squeal. Ow, ow, Let's ow, hit him ow. some more. That's enough. Otherwise, I'll tell the teacher and you'll go to jail. You're a tattletale, JJ. We'll beat you again tomorrow, piggy. What? It's not going to happen. You're going to regret this. Bye-bye, pig. Go lose weight, you idiot. Oh, my God. That was so scary. Why do other people even care what I look like? You guys, do you like fat people? Write about it in the comments. I don't feel like eating anything. It's time for me to go to class. Whoa, Mikey, you're such a strong boy. What's going on here? Is that Mikey? What's he doing here? Look how I can. I'm stronger than both of you put together. Wow, those are some heavy weights. Mikey, you are very cool and strong. I want to be your girlfriend. Ha <laughs> ha, and I'll think about that tasty offer. Oh, really? Will he think about it? I'd say yes. I want to date girls, too. Oh, lifting that barbell was easy. Why raise it above your head? I don't think it's safe at all. You better not be lifting that heavy stuff, girls, because I'm the strongest person in this school. I'm sure of it, Mikey. You're an excellent boy. Oh my god, I'm sick of looking at this. Why are some people thin and strong and I'm fat and ugly? Friends, are you as fat as me? Write about it in the comments. I don't feel like studying at all today. I feel so bad. I hate skinny people. Moments later. I'm such a miserable fat dude. No girls look at me. I get teased and beat up at school. Mikey insults me. Even my parents think I'm inferior. It's all horrible. And I can't do anything about it at all. No one will even feel sorry for me. All I can do is cry here in the rain. And nobody's gonna help me. How can anyone help me? I think a can of Coke would make me happier. And when is this bus gonna get here? I'm not walking home at all. Baby, what are you doing here? You can get wet and sick in the rain. Uh, what? Is someone here? Oh my God, you're such a huge pumped up man. Oh yeah, I'm pumped. What happened to you? What's wrong? The problem is that I'm fat. Everyone hates me. And it's too hard for me to lose weight. I'd say it's impossible. I'm so overweight. And that's your problem? <laughs> it's such a trifle. I can easily help you. You can go to my gym and you'll have huge arms like me. Chicks love big arms. You'll lose weight and become a pumped up handsome guy. I'm gonna lose weight? It's too hard for me. I can't do it. Don't underestimate yourself, kid. People can do a lot of things, including you. Let's go to my gym. I'll make you the most pumped up dude in your school. Wow, are you serious? That would be awesome. I'm the coach. I like helping losers like you. <laughs> well, now you're insulting me too. You know, I'm used to it. Stop talking. It's time for you to go to the gym to shake your belly fat. <laughs> Follow me, man. Okay, just don't go so fast. I can't keep up with you. Because you're too fat. That's why you're so slow. Oh my God, we've been walking for so long. When are we gonna get to your gym? <laughs> We're here now, baby. Here's my super cool gym. And why are you calling me baby? That's not cool at all. Because you're fat and small, baby. <laughs> then I'll get pumped up strong and big and then no one will dare call me that word. Now that's a mindset I like already. Those are the words of a potential jock. You're guaranteed success, baby. <laughs> oh my God, this is really pissing me off. Let's go to your gym already. Come on, let's go. You're gonna love it here. Make yourself at home, kid. Wow, this is really cool. It's just weird that we're the only ones in your gym. Doesn't anyone want to get big and strong? Because everyone's embarrassed to be with a cool dude like me. <laughs> then where do I start? You seem smart enough to give me good advice. Hmm. Let me think about it. I think you should do some cardio and run on the treadmill first. What? But there are so many interesting machines here and you're telling me to run. Yes, because I'm the coach. I know how to do it right. Oh my God. I don't think this is going to be easy at all. Three hours later. Pretty good, but if you break down my doors again, I'll take you to court. I just don't fit in the doorway because I'm a huge, pumped up dude. I'm even bigger than my trainer. Look at me, I'm so pumped up. All the girls will be mine. I hate you. You're always ruining my gym for me. Oh my god, I feel like I've become invulnerable. Guys, who's cooler? A jock or a fat dude? 
write about it in the comments. I like the shape of the jock better because no one would dare call me names or hit me now. Ha 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 All right, hold me, everybody. I'm going to go get my girls from Mikey. Like my coach used to say, all girls like big hands. Ha ha ha. I'm sure the girls will definitely love it, and I don't seem like a creepy monster at all. With these muscles, I could be a real ladies' man. When Mikey sees me, he will definitely be dumbfounded by my muscle bulk. Hey, hey, everybody, a real jock here, not some poser. That's exactly how my awesome muscles grow. Oh, yeah. Your biceps are so big and hard, Mikey. I want to touch it. You can touch me wherever you want. Get your hands off that skinny boy and look at me. Ha, ha, ha. I'm so much cooler than him. Is that JJ? Wow, you're so pumped up and cool. We want to be friends with you. Ha, ha. I want to be friends with all you girls. And you, Mikey, you can keep sitting alone in that gym. You're the worst friend ever. Don't swear. We'll be your best friends. Oh, yeah. As they say, girls love big hands. Ha, ha, ha. Oh, but how did you lose weight so fast? I trained with the best trainer in town, and you're a total loser. We don't need Mikey anymore. We need you, JJ. Then let's all go to my house. We'll kiss and hug. Wow. I would love to do that with you. I'll make it with all of you. Ha, ha, ha. I am now strong and successful, all thanks to the gym. We all want to touch your abs and biceps. You can touch me all over my body. One day later. I've been playing on the computer for a week now, and I don't go to school. I love it so much. But today, my parents asked me to go at least once or I'll be kicked out. Oh my god, I lost my school books. Look at him, he's so stupid. I have to hurry up or I'll be scolded by the teacher. Oh my god, he's starting to make me nervous with his behavior. Okay, I just need to find a couple notebooks and a textbook for school. Hey, Mikey, come here. I have a very important mission for you. I'm actually busy, don't distract me. Come here, I'm in chief of this house. Did you prepare my school bag? Oh, yeah. It's already done. Don't worry, JJ. Wow. Perfect timing. You'd make a good maid, Mikey. You're my little brother, JJ. I'm always happy to help you with anything. Actually, I'm your big brother. You have to help me. Oh, Mom's here. Hello, children. Are you ready for school? They are always ready. Especially JJ prepared the best. It's time to go to school. After all, it's already 7 a.m. on the clock. Your classes will start soon. Oh, yeah. I'm ready for school, Dad, and I packed my own backpack. Actually, I did it for you. Shut up, Mikey. You've been too aggressive lately. Don't forget that I'm the boss here. Um, okay, just don't swear. Are you ready, children? Yes, Captain. I mean, yes, Mom. Another dumb joke from Mikey. We will take you to school by car. Come on, let's get in the car. Otherwise, you will be late. I'm finally going to drive to school instead of walking. Comfort is not familiar to you at all, Mikey. <laughs> Your words don't offend me at all. And why do we help our children at all? They can walk to school by themselves. We must pretend to be a good and caring family. It's a pity that we are not. Can you stop talking already? At this this rate, we will definitely be late for school. Well, all right. JJ is right as always. Get in the car, everyone. Did you know that our backpacks are the same color as our clothes? Get in the car. No one cares about it. Friends, do you also like to bully your younger brothers? Write about it in the comments. I love doing this. Oh, and what were you talking about? I told you you stink so much. Do you ever wash yourself? It's not funny at all, JJ. I just washed up. That's a lie. <laughs> So we arrived at our favorite school. Your favorite school? I hate this stupid school. Boring teachers and uninteresting classmates so much. You haven't even seen your classmates in their faces. By the way, look over there. Well, what's there? Wow, like and subscribe. This is what we need our viewers to do. I generally like every video at all. Well done, Mikey. You're setting a good example for all our viewers. Because not many people have been putting likes lately. What a beautiful school here. Oh, what kind of school girl is this? It looks like she's a new girl at our school. Then we need to get to know her. Oh, yeah, she looks really cute. Hey, honey, wait. Are you new here? Uh, yeah. What a nice and beautiful girl. He's kind of weird. If we get to know each other better, I'll be anyone for you. Oh, how sweet that is. That would be cool. How long have you been studying here? I often skipped school lessons. I've been here since yesterday. So we can become the best of friends with you. Um, dude, you're too weird. Oh, yeah. Mikey is like that. By the way, it's time for you to go to class. Otherwise, the teacher might scold you. Then we should go together. No, you're going alone. I'm going to stay here for now. Well, I'm going to study. Good luck to you guys. Get out of here. It's getting too stuffy in here. Are you the coolest dude in school? Oh, yeah. I'm the coolest and most dangerous kid in school. Everyone is afraid of me. So, I'll be friends with you, JJ. For some reason, JJ is not in a hurry to go to lessons at all. What is he doing? Otherwise, it's boring for me to sit there alone. Oh, my God. You know, you're a cool guy. I like you, JJ. Ha, ha, ha. You're definitely not the first person to tell me this, darling. 
Wow, you're so cool. Maybe we should go to my house. Shall we talk and watch cartoons together? It sounds fun. Let's go. Um, it's kind of unpleasant. Actually, I wanted to talk to that new girl, and JJ ruined everything again. Well, I'm going to study alone. I was tricked again. Three hours later. Hello, everyone again. How nice it is to walk with a girl by the hand. And we also kissed. I really liked it. It's time to study at school a little bit, although I think I skipped all the lessons altogether. Oh, that's the inscription. Guys, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like this video. Mikey, hi. JJ, why didn't you come to class? Um, I had more important things to do. I saw that girl off. By the way, she lives in a cool big house. And we were holding hands. She's certainly a bit stupid, but she's cute. Oh, it's not cool at all. Such girls surround me all the time. It's so easy for me to kiss them. You should have known that. But it's still very nice. Ha ha ha. I think I'll talk to that girl again. She's still beautiful. Stop talking about it already. I hate to hear that. What do you mean? What's the big deal? I just hate to hear it. I thought you were my friend, JJ. I'm your brother. But you act like you're a complete stranger to me. I'm offended by you, JJ. That's not what real brothers do to each other. Um, I didn't do anything. Stop accusing me of something. I don't understand. Well, don't understand who else is stupid here. You can go home alone. What? And where did he go? Mikey is so touchy. Friends, why is Mikey offended by me? Write about it in the comments. She doesn't know yet what a bad guy JJ can be. I'm a hundred times better than him. Oh, it looks like this is the house that JJ was talking about. She might be living here. That's the big house from his words. I would live here with her too. And what if she doesn't like me? I'm kind of scared to approach her, but I can't be afraid. I'm a man. I have to take action right now. Besides, I have a beautiful rose. She'll be crazy about it. After all, all girls love flowers. Oh, looks like I've prepared enough to seduce this girl. Open the doors. Your future groom has arrived. And why doesn't anyone open it? And who is making noise here? Oh, Mikey, uh, hello. What are you doing here? Hello, baby. It's good to see you. You're a baby yourself. What do you need? The thing is, I really like you, and I also love you. I want you to be my girlfriend. I think we'll make a great couple. Do you agree to this attractive proposal? Um, how do I explain it to you, Mikey? I don't like you at all, and you better get out of here as soon as possible. Hey, honey, and where did you go, Mikey? What are you doing here? He came to confess his love to me. He's so weird. Oh my God, what? Ha ha ha, how funny it is. Actually, I'm dating her. Um, this can't be happening. I liked her first. Mikey, you didn't have a chance. Besides, you're a total loser. Oh yeah, JJ's much cooler, dude. And you stink. Get out of here and take your stupid rose with you. Ha ha ha, you're really messing with him. Oh my God, nobody needs me. My own brother betrayed me. Oh my God, we got a crybaby in here. <laughs> Mikey, stop crying and go back to your mom. You're all traitors and freaks. Nobody loves me in this world. What? Don't call us freaks. But you're right about one thing. Nobody wants you here. Get out of here now, you stupid romantic. I hope your mom doesn't feel sorry for you. Uh, I think Mikey was really upset. Don't even think about feeling sorry for him. Then let's go on kissing, JJ. Oh yeah, I like that. And I don't care about Mikey at all. Let's go to the second floor. We haven't finished our cartoon yet. Oh yeah, I love cartoons. I hope it won't be SpongeBob. No, it's going to be Tom and Jerry. This is the coolest cartoon in the world. Tom and Jerry? Wow, that's really cool. I haven't watched this for a long time. Let's go, let's go. Moments later. <laughs> <laughs> Why are all the girls always dating the bad guys? It's not fair at all. Maybe I'm boring, ugly, and not cool. JJ was right. I'm too pathetic. I can't talk to girls. I stutter and worry all the time, but he doesn't. I'm so poor, and no one will feel sorry for me. All I can do is sit here and cry. Stop crying, baby. Ha ha ha. Oh my god, who are you? You're so huge. Am I big? Ha ha ha. What are you whining about, baby? And it's not cool to sit here in the rain, kid. You can get sick. Tell me about your problems. I want to help you. My brother is bullying me, and he also started dating a girl that I like. <laughs> They also called me a crybaby. It was so insulting. I want to be with that girl. I want to hold her hand. I want to kiss her and so on. But it's like the whole world is against me. I'm so unlucky and I do not know what to do. <laughs> is that your problem? This is complete nonsense. You just need to sign up for my gym. All women love big hands, just like mine. <laughs> I can become your personal trainer. You will become big and strong. So what? Uh, do you agree to change your life? 
Look, I've got nothing to lose anyway. I think I can give it a try. At least if I become as strong as you, I can beat JJ. And believe me, it's definitely worth it. That's good. <laughs> then follow me. I'll show you the coolest gym in this town. Oh, you're so tall and strong. If you wanted to, you could crush me with one foot. <laughs> I don't hit little kids, but I promise you'll soon be just like me. Oh, that's great. I'm already picturing punching JJ's face. <laughs> you're a funny kid. Two hours later. That's it. A little steroids, trenbolone, dinotrophenol, and you're a super strong bodybuilder. Oh, yeah. That's what I wanted. Now I'm the most dangerous student in my school. Why did you break down the walls, you idiot? Because I'm super strong. Because you're super dumb. Oh, my God. You broke my gym. That's okay. You can build yourself a new one. I've got a couple important things to do. I won't help people like you anymore. Oh, my God. JJ, I'm coming to you. Haha. <laughs> yeah, Tom and Jerry is over. Uninteresting SpongeBob has begun. He pisses me off. Yeah. I don't have any other cartoons. It's not a big deal. I enjoy watching you more than the TV. JJ, you're such a romantic. Wait, I hear something rumbling outside. Oh, uh, what are you talking about? Ha ha ha, here I am, babies. Oh my god, Mikey, is that really you? Yeah, it's me, JJ. I got pretty pumped up while you guys were watching stupid cartoons. What do you need those muscles for? Because girls like big hands, ha ha ha. Oh my god, I don't like this at all. I don't like it either, Mikey, get out of here. You're not telling me what to do here, JJ. I'm going to hit you now. Hey, what? What do you mean? For what? I didn't do anything. Stop. Come here, baby. You deserve it. I didn't deserve this. Oh, no. Boys, stop fighting. Ha, ha, ha. Don't run away from me, little chicken. Ah, uh, no. Oh, yeah. No. Ah, uh, ouch. Ah. Relax. Ah, ah, I, ouch. Meanwhile, I'm playing on the playground with Mikey today. Look at how much he's grown. Oh, yeah, I grew up pretty good because I ate a lot. My mom always said I would grow up big and strong if I ate a big meal. Our mom was right. You just have to know how to moderate it so you don't get super fat. And it's not cool to be fat at all. And to keep from getting fat, you need to move more. Run, jump, and play outside. Leading an active lifestyle is not cool at all, I guess. Playing on the computer all day and drinking Coke all the time, that's cool. Some of the viewers might think you're not joking. Mikey is. You shouldn't listen to him at all. Oh, look, there's a dude over there. All right, I'll put the poster here. I also need to put one in 20 other places. There's some kind of money contest, Mikey. I hope the fat heads come to this event. Fatties? Can other people go in there? This is all kind of weird. Let's go see what this poster is. It's got some kind of burger on it, and we both really like burgers. Hamburger eating contest. The prize is 100 diamonds. Whoa, so you can eat burgers and get a huge prize. I will eat all the burgers in this competition. After that, you and I will be fabulously rich. Oh, yeah. That's the attitude of a real winner. Let's go out there and beat all those fat guys. These fatties can't do anything. I could eat these burgers for the rest of my life and not even get fat, unlike them. Yeah, Mikey, you're the coolest burger eater ever. And here's the place. McDonald's, the most popular hamburger place in the world. Well, there are places that make better hamburgers. It's always dirty and smelly. But for 100 diamonds, you can stop whining and be patient, JJ. Let's finally eat all the burgers in here. I can whine all I want, but you're still gonna have to eat. Ha 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 ha. Because you're so small and weak, you can't even fit two burgers. Wow, there's a lot of people here, and they're all entering the contest? Burgers in 30 seconds? What? You have to eat as many burgers as you can in that amount of time? Some dude ate 19 grand. That's impossible. Are you sure you can beat him? I don't know. I've never eaten so many burgers in 30 seconds in my life. But I'll give it a try. I think I can do it. It's all wimps in here. I'm much better and faster than them. You're the biggest hamburger lover in the world. Let's go to the register. We'll sign you up for this competition. I hope all those burgers don't fly out your mouth after you've eaten them. No, they're gonna stay in my tummy for a long time. This is the man throwing up who only ate 19 burgers. He probably saw a hamburger for the first time in his life. Oh, yeah. I've already realized how cool you are. I hope you can prove it in practice, braggart. Hello! You must want to sign up for our contest? We have a prize of 100 diamonds. That's a lot of money. Yeah, I want in. I'm definitely gonna win. Okay. You have to eat the maximum number of hamburgers in 30 seconds. And you don't have to throw up. He'll eat 30 burgers in 30 seconds. A burger a second. Ha 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 I'm ready for any challenge. All right. Then I'll get your first burger now. Oh, I'm starting to get worried. Stop worrying, Mikey. I remember when you used to eat 
eat a hundred of these burgers in a day. Oh, yeah. I was really good back then. I hope I can do the same today. I've got everything set up for the start of the competition. Here's your portion. Don't choke on it. <laughs> it's such a small burger. I'll eat it in a second. Why did they put fried potatoes in there? For beauty. No one's gonna eat it here. My main focus is hamburgers. Let's go! Moments later. Friends, could you beat Mikey in this contest? Write about it in the comments. I think you'd all lose because Mikey is a born burger eater. 30 burgers a second. That's a real monster winner. Mikey wins. I'm so proud of him. Now he gets his 100 diamonds. He's so cool. Let's take a look at our champion. Mikey, congratulations. I don't think your friend's feeling well. What? Mikey, are you okay? I can't eat these burgers anymore. Mikey, you've gotten fat. Your arms and body have doubled in size. Oh, yeah. Yeah, our burgers are very fatty and juicy. I want to get my diamonds and go home. And here they are, by the way. You did a great job of eating 30 burgers in 30 seconds. Oh yeah, I'm the coolest guy in this McDonald's. Here are your diamonds. Congratulations. They'll be safe with me. Ha ha ha. Thank you so much for this competition. We will spend this money wisely. Let's go home, Mikey. You did a good job today. Oh yeah, time for a little break from eating so many burgers. Oh yeah. Ouch. Oh, Mikey's down. What happened? Is the floor slippery? Get up. Oh my god. God, looks like our winner's not feeling well. That's not cool at all. What are we supposed to do now? Will he live? Help him. How am I supposed to help him? He's just full of burgers. Take him outside and he'll feel better. It has 30 burgers in him. He's heavy. Guys, I dragged him to the nearest bench. He was so heavy and fat. Just look at him. He's still asleep. Mikey, wake up, champ. I can't drag you home. He's still sleeping. Stop sleeping, Mikey. You're so annoying. The new burgers are coming. Ugh, I don't want any more burgers. Of course you don't. You ate 30 grand and you're super fat. Look at you. You're ugly. Oh, so what? Fat people are trendy right now. You haven't heard anything about body positivity. What kind of body positivity is that? That's no excuse for being a fat pig. I'm fat from that contest. It's not my fault I'm fat, but I'm rich. Yeah, you're good for earning a bunch of diamonds, but it's time to lose the weight. I don't want to drop anything. I feel great, but my stomach hurts a little. Of course it hurts because you ate too much. So what do you suggest I do? Now I'm gonna live like this for the rest of my life. Get up and let me show you what you have to do. Soon you'll be back to your old, skinny, handsome Mikey self. I'm already handsome and good looking. No, 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 you're fat and ugly, Mikey. It's time to lose weight. Follow me, I'll show you something. Um, okay, I wish there was some kind of diet pill. There's no such pill, Mikey. We're gonna take your weight the old fashioned way. And here's the place I wanted to show you, the gym. This is where we're going to do all sorts of physical activities. They'll make you lose weight. JJ, you're running too fast. Please wait for me. Oh my God, you're so slow and fat. Oh, at least I'm fed and happy. And imagine how happy you'll be if you get pumped up and strong. JJ, you gotta be kidding me. I can't even look at this stuff after the burgers. That's all very cool, but I'm gonna pass. I'm gonna go sleep at my house. Hey, wait, what's sleep? You're not going anywhere. I don't need this. Stop right there. Come here, you fat pig. Look at your belly, it's so big. I'll be your personal trainer. During these days, we will turn you not into a burger eating champion champion, but into a heavy weightlifting champion. I don't think that's a good idea, JJ. It's up to me to decide if it's a good idea or not. I'll make an even bigger man out of you, but it won't be your belly that's big. It'll be your muscles. Oh, muscles. I like that already. Okay, let's go work out. I'm gonna be the coolest gym buddy in the world. Then let's start with the treadmill. It's time to shake off your burger fat. Let's go. Oh, fu uh, ouch. This is so hard for me. Keep running, Mikey. If you stay this fat, they'll make burger patties out of you. Run, Mikey. Run. I'm running. Would try it myself if you want to show it to me. Coaches don't play, Mikey. Stop talking and keep running. Let's go faster. The faster, the better. How long do I have to run like this? You have five hours of non-stop running left. So cool. Oh, God, I can't take it. You can do it. And now the barbell bench press. This exercise will make your chest and your triceps huge. That's it. Keep lifting weights, Mikey. It's really hard. I want to rest, JJ. You don't have time to rest. Do it again, and then we'll give you another 50 pounds. Lift the bar. Get up. Oh, yeah. I can feel my muscles growing. Nice job, Mikey. Way to go. Good boy. And this exercise will make your shoulders firm and broad. Keep it up, Mikey. You're doing great. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's it. I like it already. Ha, ha, ha. I don't see it on your face. Then you need to get some heavier dumbbells. Oh, no. I can't lift a heavier dumbbell. That would be unnecessary. I'm the one who decides what's 
unnecessary for you and what's not. Oh my god. Four to six days later. Hey friends, would you like to be pumped up and cool? Write about it in the comments. Look at that Mikey. He's really pumped up. Such a cool dude. He's been training with my program. I'm so proud of him. Oh yeah. I'm very pleased with myself. There's no fat in my body at all now. Just muscle. I'm so handsome and cool. And he accomplished all of this by working out at the gym. Now I can look in the mirror with pleasure. I really like my body. If I have a fat viewer watching me, go to the gym. It's great. Even if you're not fat but thin, still go to the gym. Being so pumped and strong is very cool and healthy. Oh yeah, I feel like I could beat any passerby with my left hand. That's how strong I am. You're so strong, you can break houses with your hands. Someday I'll work out and be as strong as you. And I remember how fat and pathetic I was. I hate to remember those times. Oh yeah, you're rich and pumped now. Now all the girls will want to date you. Whoa, it's that dude from McDonald's. Look. Right there. I hope someone breaks that green TV man's old record? Hey, guys, come to the burger eating contest. It pays 100 diamonds to win. Uh, Mikey, this is the contest where you got fat. Would you like to enter a second time? I think you can beat everyone again and get yourself 100 diamonds. I don't know, JJ. I don't feel like going in there. I mean, it pays a lot of money. You're also eating free burgers. Are you sure about that? Yeah, I'm sure of it. I'm not going in there. I don't want to be that fat and ugly again. That's the right decision, Mikey. You did good. Burger Burgers are good on their own, but if you eat them one at a time... Oh yeah, let's go pump some more. I feel like I can get even stronger and bigger. Wow, that's the spirit. I used to make you do exercises. You're so cool. I will now go to the gym on my own, without any rebuke or instruction, because I like it. That's it, Mikey. Soon you'll be the strongest man in the world. At least I hope so. At least I'm stronger than you, little bug. Ha ha ha. Hey, that's a shame. Soon I'll build up my muscles and be as big as you. Then come to the gym to work out with me. We'll be the two strongest brothers. Oh, yes. By the way, you can do exercises not only in the gym, but also at home, doing push-ups and squats. At least a regular exercise in the morning will definitely not hurt you. Come on, Mikey. Get those dumbbells over your head. Oh, yeah, just like that. He's unstoppable. <laughs>